Hi everyone, this is Carol. Welcome back to VidPro Guide Tutorial. In this series, we will walk you through how to create stunning video with VidPro Vlogger. But before we dive into the journey, make sure you check out the link in the description box down below to download the software for free. Alright, so now, let's get the video started. As we create a video, we would record some audio sound like human voice or music into the video. But due to the surrounding noise and the recording equipment, these audio files may deviate from what they actually sound like. And this is when we need to use the equalizer to restore the original sound. VidProc Vlogger offers a 10-band graphic equalizer to help you optimize the sound. And users could drag the sliders to customize settings. But don't worry if you are new, the software provides you with multiple presets to work with, so you can easily adjust them in one click. Before we dive into the video, let's walk you through a little background in case you don't know what we are discussing about here. An equalizer is an audio filter to increase, reduce the volume of certain frequencies and to restore the original tone of these sounds. To use the equalizer in VidProc, you need to import an audio sound first. Well, it could be a piece of music or pure vocals. Drag it into the timeline. Select it and click on Audio Tool in the toolbar. Find the equalizer in the Audio Editor window that pops up. Click it. To open the equalizer, the frequency runs through the horizontal axis, while the volume runs through the vertical axis from minus 20 decibel to 20 decibel. Down here we can see 14 presets. These presets are the predetermined volume adjustment for frequency based on the audio genre. When you select a preset, the frequency sliders will move up or down to boost or call down the volume in decibel. Import an audio file like before. Click Audio Tool and then choose Equalizer. Here we are in the Editing panel. Well, if you know nothing about Equalizer, the quickest way is to use the presets and find one you like. Click the Play button here to play the audio in real time. During which, you are still allowed to change presets or just the parameters. Also check or uncheck Enable Equalizer to compare the difference. You can stick to the preset setting or we'll make just minor changes based on the preset. Click Reset All to abort a change and leave the audio unchanged. Or you can manually adjust the equalizer to increase the clarity of the vocal sound. Here we will share with you some useful tips. First, low cut. This refers to reducing the volume at a frequency below 50 to 120 Hz. The sound comes in this range of frequency usually is not a human voice, but something caused by the ambient noise. Hi everyone, this is Carol. Welcome back to the official channel VidPro Vlogger. And thus, through reducing the volume at a low frequency, the human voice could appear clearer. Hi everyone, this is Carol. Welcome back to the official channel VidProc Vlogger. The second is to add energy to vocals. If the voice is too thin, here is a lake called the Vatnate, also known as Neuvatnate, which is located at the municipality of Stream in Vestnet County. Norway. And you want to give it more energy. Try to adjust the volume in a band of 125 Hz to 1000 Hz. Here is a lake called the Vatnate, 
also known as Neuvetnet, which is located at the municipality of Stream in Vestnet County, Norway. The third tip here is to get rid of the sibilants. Sibilants are the fricative consonants that come with intense s and s sound of 5,000 to 8,000 Hz. Reducing the sibilants in this band could help soften the vocal sound. Sibilants are the fricative consonants that come with intense s and s sound. Here, I will explain to you the established frequency range of some audio sound to help you make adjustment on equalizer isolated. A final reminder here, people perceive voice and sound differently. Thus, the adjustment made on equalizer vary from person to person, and you don't have to fix your change on specific value. Do whatever you want as long as you like it. Alright, now you've reached end of today's video about audio equalizer in VidiPro Vlogger. I think you've got it. Anyway, don't forget to click the subscribe button to subscribe if you haven't yet. We will see you soon in our last guide tutorial. Hope you enjoy. Bye bye.